The Nike blazer I feel perfectly encapsulates my fashion journey. I think anybody can rock this sneaker, and there's a variant for everyone. From the regular blazer mid-77s all the way to the newly released acronym blazer, which blends military-inspired suiting with cyberpunk and modularity. There is a whole spectrum to this that I personally think can reach everyone, and is what makes this such a ubiquitous sneaker in the community. Let's start with the OG mid-77s. As a young kid in second grade seeing Lil Bow Wow hooping like Mike, the Blazers were crazy. Even though the sneaker in the movie wasn't a Jordan sneaker, which is kind of funny. But ever since then, I've always wanted a pair. After all, this sneaker was released almost 50 years ago as a basketball sneaker. And we know how much basketball has had an impact in fashion. You've got that vintage look with the slim profile, the exposed foam, the Nike font. And really, after 50 years, nothing has really changed. It still stays classic to the OG design. Got that herringbone midsole, the extra panels of material on the toe cap, the high cuts, even though it is considered a mid. And they take four hours to take off. Right here, I have the Celestial blue mid 77s i believe this is the exact one from like mike and i have the maroon colorway as well which i did do a cream lace swap and i think it really makes the sneaker pop i'll leave a link in the description so i really like showing off the entire sneaker since it's so slim i mean they're kind of like converse just with a little bit more color so cuffed pants is my go-to but also i like the mids instead of the low tops because if i do decide to lay my pants over the sneakers it still looks like a low top two sneakers for the price of one basically i think it's the perfect sneaker for any type of streetwear outfit you you just can't go wrong with a pair of these. I personally would suggest getting these over Air Force Ones, over Jordans if you're just starting out. But yeah, the slim silhouettes, the vulcanized sole wasn't only loved on the courts. It was very useful to the up and coming subculture of skating. So after my short obsession with basketball, I then picked up skateboarding in middle school and I was pretty nice with it for my age. Till this day, my most impactful hobby as a kid. Anyway, skaters found these were perfect. Good board feel, a little bit more durability for the time. It was definitely useful for flip tricks and most importantly, somewhat affordable and eventually as skateboarding became more mainstream and popularized by games like tony hawk nike created their own subdivision nike sb and revamped a ton of sneakers like the nike dunk to the sb dunk and eventually the blazer with more durable materials padding and better technology for impact birthing the now extremely popular skate shoe the nike sb blazer now with me growing up lower class no way i can get these i was basically skating any sneaker silhouettes my parents could afford from the department store and wanting every popular sneaker, some Lakai's, Fallen's, Dunks, and Blazers. And now with age, I can finally afford these. Real quick, guys, I have a word from the sponsor of today's video, Soul Premise. Soul Premise is my go-to travel bag now. Especially if you're a sneakerhead or you take a lot of fit pics, you're gonna really love this one. See, with a normal carry-on, you can really only carry about two sneakers max before you fill the rest up with toiletries, clothes, and all that. This Soul Premise bag allows you to fit up to five sneakers while having enough space for your other essentials like your laptop, gear, and even other clothes. It's TSA approved and used by a number of NBA players. And yeah, check this out. You've got dedicated sneaker compartments so your clothes don't really touch the sneaker. I know I can be weird like that, I'm a germaphobe. And the other compartments are for more sneakers, more storage, and even a standard backpack compartment which has a laptop sleeve, some organization and all that. It's a very useful bag, especially for me. I can get some work done at the coffee shop. I can bring sneakers I need to shoot B-roll for. They've got duffel bags, regular backpacks, rolling bags, the whole suite. There's definitely something for everyone. I personally have the Signature Bag XL. It is big, but on a day I gotta shoot or travel, it's definitely my go-to. And finally, they even have a bottom compartment to fit even more sneakers. These bags are made with a very nice tumbled leather with a simplistic design, plenty of colors, or black if you'd like, but you know, I got this camel color to spruce it up a little bit, you know? And it's definitely gonna last a long time. I mean, it really is the only way to travel now for myself. If you guys ever run into me at the airport, I'll definitely be rocking this. Definitely click that link in the description. Check out Soul Premise. And thank you, Soul Premise, for sponsoring this video. Also, guys, if you guys want a huge discount, Soul Premise is offering 40% off if you guys use my discount code TAI. That is linked in the description. Back to the video. So the ones I'm holding here are the Nike SB Zoom Blazer Mid Premiums. My favorite variant of the SB Blazer there's plenty of other variants of just Nike SB blazers alone. It comes with zoom technology in the insole, more durability in the high wear areas like the toe cap and heel, and it has this sweet colorway that is perfect for the spring. Absolutely love these. I haven't skated them yet because my go-to is the SB blazer mid edge, which as you can see, it kind of has that deconstructed DIY look. The swoosh looks like it was ripped off and placed on the toe cap, 
and it works. It's still holding up. Plus there's extra materials around the heel area for heel flips, much appreciated. And especially now, these came out last year and the year before. They're relatively affordable on the resale market. I have the maroon colorway and the white canvas colorway, both sexy sneakers with that double tongue, crazy mix of colors and a unique look. A perfect sneaker to skate in, but will also look great in street fits as well. I'd say get at least one pair of SB ones if you are into blazers and you have the space for it in your closet. There's a lot of unique looking ones. And now with today's day and age, there is no doubt that collaborations have pushed streetwear and fashion to the masses. Before you'd get called a kid for wearing sneakers instead of loafers. I never really understood that because it's kind of childish to make fun of someone for not wearing... Anyways, fashion is much more casual nowadays and nothing gets the community going than a good old highly anticipated sneaker collaboration. I mean, there have been so many with just the blazer itself, most notably the collaboration with Off-White back in 2017, which basically brought the sneaker back to life. It was on its way out before the skaters picked it up, then it died down again. Off-White brought it back to life with the 10 and they brought it to a wide audience that was mainly into Boost at the time. Good old days. I mean, recently there have been many awesome takes on this design just within the last year. The Sakai Blazer being one of them with a crazy stacked heel. Definitely going to get my hands on one of these. And cool, interesting concepts like the ready made blazers right over here. By the way, shout out to Stadium Goods for having me and gifting me these sneakers. So, designed by a Japanese brand and inspired by DIY and upcycling, the RE on the tags can stand for words like reuse and recycle. The outsole was partially made out of leftover Nike material. You can just see the specs of color, really unique. And this collaboration specifically pushes consumers to think about those concepts. Always a great thing in my opinion. And it's just a really cool take on the silhouettes. Definitely one of my favorites and definitely the future of sneaker design. Speaking of which, this is the Nike acronym blazer lows which goes crazy definitely a lot of forward thinking concepts with this design and currently a lot of people just don't understand this sneaker which is kind of why a lot of people don't really like it well i'm about to clue you in let's start off with the gilly inspired cutouts of the acronym logo in layman's terms just think of sniper suit from cod while not my favorite design choice it definitely sets these apart and fits well within the nike acronym capsule that just released but the heel the heel is the story of the sneaker. So what's really cool is they've actually provided the actual source code to allow you to 3D model anything you want and replace the heel cup anytime. You can totally customize the sneaker to you if you know 3D modeling and design. Of course, this leaves the power to the consumers, which is just what makes this sneaker so special. You can sell designs, you can just share it if you'd like. There's a whole community behind it. So basically everyone with an acronym blazer can have a different take on just this silhouette. I've seen crazy designs where there's like rockets in the back or even some that make it look like a high top. And honestly, it's probably even gonna birth future sneaker designers. I mean, I probably appreciate it more because I was a former mechanical engineer. I used to design products in college. But yeah, basically how it works is there's a dog tag attached to the sneaker, which allows you to take the heel cup off. You can use a drill, of course. And yeah, you can just go crazy with the heel cup designs. Cool concepts, skateboarding, basketball, streetwear. As you can see, there is a sneaker variant for everyone, all of which impact us individually or the community by fueling our nostalgia or inspiring the future so what's your favorite silhouette is it the classic is it the collaborations let me know what your favorite model is in the comments down below i love blazers probably pick up one of your suggestions if you guys enjoyed the video give it a like subscribe to the channel follow my other socials and until then stay fly deuces